Okay, other PR companies, don't even try. This is the biggest package I've gotten, and wait till I open it, you will poop your pants. Because I almost did. Yeah, it's like a huge book. You open it like this, and then you scream because it is filled from left to right with Pixie products. These are all of their collabs. So they've got collabs with, this is Carolyn Herons. Um, I've not heard of her, but the Double Cleanse is the product that she collaborated with Pixie on. Then we'll move up here. We've got Miriam, who I have followed for a while, so I knew who this was right away. Love her. And she's got... Let's zoom in here. She has um, a strobe and bronze and then strobe and sculpt. So you got your like highlight and contour and a special brush for applying. Let's move down over here. Okay, this is someone I did not know until this collab. Her name is Aspie Novard or Aspen maybe is her her real first name. Um, but she has got you covered with the highlight as well as a blush, I believe. And then this is, um, what is that? Uh, lower lash mascara, that's cool. I actually love specific mascara for the lower lash line because most brushes kind of overwhelm those lashes. And we've got clear brow gel tamer, which I love for the brushed up brow trend. Why am I out of breath right now? <laughs> then we've got my fave Judy of It's Judy Time. I have probably watched Judy longer than anyone, um, really, in the beauty community. And she has lip palettes, and I think, let's see here, there's an eyeshadow palette as well as a lip palette. Yeah, so you've got your, your color products here from, from Judy. So this is the most baller, like, PR package I've ever received. I, I feel so grateful to Pixie because this was so fun to open, and I will be reviewing the products individually, certain ones that I feel like really stand out, and of course I will tell you what I think of them. So here is a cute package from Pure Cosmetics. This is a new product for them. I've not seen this before. Here's a little note. Um, hi Ivy, we're so excited to have to share our new cruelty-free pro lashes made in collab with celebrity makeup artist Melanie Viger. Beaker. Um, that's got her Instagram handle. So yeah, Pure Cosmetics has not had lashes before, but now they do, and they are cruelty free, which I love and require to even talk about. And um, we'll look through these. I am not a big lash person. I mean, I never wear them. I love them on other people, and I almost always apply them to clients. So I don't know that I'll use these, but some of my clients might benefit. Okay, so there are several styles, and some are going to be more dramatic than others, and I will struggle to open them. I like the separation in these ones. I really don't like lashes that are too, like, thick black line across the whole way, so I like that there's some separation in those. These ones are called Bombshell. These do appear to be some of the more fuller style, so they, they don't have as much separation, maybe a little thicker band, so that's the Bombshell ones. Then, let's see, what do we have over here? Socialite. So, these are the Socialite ones. These seem a little more minimal. They are not as dense, and they seem to be a little wispier at the tips, kind of a taper at the ends. These ones are called Jet Setter, and I think these would probably be my favorite for personal use because I don't like false lashes to be too dramatic, and they have quite a bit of separation. So they're just gonna kinda like fill in, but not you know, have this heavy strip across your whole lash line. And last but not least, we have Trendsetter. So these ones are kind of a good mix. They are, they're wispy enough, but they do have um, a little more volume at the root, as you can see, and they're very feathery at the tips. So that is Trendsetter. So Pure Cosmetics has six new styles of cruelty-free lashes. And if you are a lash person, these look like really nice quality and I think that these will be um, ones that you would actually want to reuse multiple times. They have 3D silk fibers. That's what they're made of, but they are synthetic. And now I'll show you what I have from Aveda that is new. This is their wedding mask and their eye mask. Um, they are the Tula Sar line and they contain um, very hydrating ingredients. So these are kind of like overnight products that you would use. So I don't know if you can see from the texture, but they are very, you know, rich and hy hydrating. Um, the eye cream is 
a firmer consistency and then the the wedding mask for the face is just like a really rich cream which I love I have really dry skin so I definitely can appreciate a very hydrating overnight treatment the face mask has shea butter and glycerin which are both very hydrating and then the eye mask has uh, molasses extract 